Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching. Noodle, we've started filming. Just let him, just let him do this. My name is Jonathan, this is Noodle, and this is my half-finished mixed drink. Feel free to use your sleeping blow dart at any point to just knock me out. This is how you be creative. Whatever, we're just gonna move on. <laughs> These are fabulous for drawing. One thing in particular that I think is true. Oh my, oh my God. What is this? <laughs> Hello? You are all fired. Hello! My name's Jonathan, this is Noodle. Thank you so much for tuning into this week's episode of Tools of the Trade. I am, as every week, so excited to share uh, this box. Wait, oh my God, I gotta explain what the show is. Tools of the Trade. Tools of the Trade is the show where we find out what everyday items our everyday entrepreneurs need to get through their day. For example, if I were an entrepreneur, the only thing I would need to get through my day is spiced rum in a mixed drink because I can't drink it straight because I'm a little uh, and I would need Noodle for moral support. We're uh, featuring Jana Hart of Bond Folk in New Orleans. What we love so much about her, not only that we were able to feature her in our Icons of Our Tribe series, which is amazing, and if you have a chance to scroll through our Instagram to check it out, please do, um, but she runs a funky sock company, but she's got a really good for good aspect of it. Every pair of socks that she sells, she ends up donating a pair as well. And one of the things that she lets us know in her Icons video is that socks are the number one most requested item for donations. Not only does she have her own lucrative business that she has a lot of fun with, but she also is able to give back to her community, which is always an absolutely um, honorable, ooh, he's so, oh my God, keep going. It's an incredibly honorable thing to do. And another thing about Jana that I love uh, is she tells us that she is kind of, she kind of is a jack of all trades at her business. So not only does she sell the socks, but she helps to source them. She, she does everything. She truly does everything. Um, and she really is one of those people who embodies what it is to make her own way. So I'm gonna take a drink. I'm gonna scratch this angel prince and we're gonna get into this box. Okay, so the first item we've got in here is a pen tablet. Uh, it's a tablet. It's a, uh, called a creative pen tablet um, that is used for digital drawing, photo editing, and managing artwork. This is something that you use when you really want to hone that craft of yours, whether you are, a, again, a photo editor or you just like to draw and you want to see it done in sort of a professional way. We can assume that this is sort of a, this must be a tool that she uses to design some, design some of her designs on. And you can make a lot of mistakes on this, right? It's not like doing things in pen. We're really thrilled with this. This is a great inclusion in this box and it makes perfect sense if you design your own products. Okay, the next item we have is, Ooh, okay, this makes sense too. These are Prismacolor art markers. So I think these kind of go in the same vein where if you're not drawing digitally, this is something that she does, obviously, when she draws manually. And I can imagine that this is really great for um, sort of collaborative efforts, right? Imagine having an outline on something and you just want to get the color right. You're getting 12. This is how you be creative. Whatever, we're just gonna move on. <laughs> these are fabulous for drawing. Okay, is this, and I think this is a sketchbook. Yeah, so this goes right along with it, um, with these markers. Let me pull out. So you've got markers, you've got a sketchbook here. So whether you want to draw something digitally, right, and manipulate it that way, or you want to draw it by hand, this is just an empty sketchbook that you can fill in with all of your favorite design. That's it. That's all this is. It's a sketchbook. Okay. The next item we have in the Jana Hart box is another fun sticker. Oh, these are the, okay, these are the socks. So these are what her socks look like. Look at these, they got flowers on them. Oh, these are so fun. And what more than anything, what's great about it is you see um, on the packaging alone, it says, at Bond Folk, we donate a pair of socks for every pair purchased. So, you, okay, he needs a treat. He needs a treat immediately. Stop whatever you're doing and get me one of these. He's desperate. He's simply desperate. Okay, Noodle. It's right here, because you're perfect. Because you're perfect and he demanded it. Did you see he goes, feed me. They are, they're made in New Orleans, one size fits most. Gotta love that, you outliers with crazy huge feet. You might be 
Not out of luck. Anyone who wins this box, anyone who goes home to this box, you guys are gonna have an incredible new pair of socks. Um, I love the floral design, and I love knowing that these were all designed in-house. There's something really fun about that. Okay, the next item we've got is... What we've got here is a bag of coffee. And I think this is indicative of many entrepreneurs, of course, and Jana is no exception. She wakes up in the morning and she's like, oh my God, I gotta do it all over again. So she has to have a cup of coffee to get started. Or even in the middle of the day, I don't know about you guys, but I don't have caffeine in the morning because I think go crazy. But if it's like three or four and I'm kind of towards the end of my day, that's something that I can, kind of treat myself to a little bit. Cause then if I start to lose my mind, at least I'm on the subway home and everyone else is crazy too. The next item we have in the Jana Heart Box is, so it's covered in Japanese characters and it says MP3 Terminator, which makes me think it could be anything, but I'm gonna open it. Sorry, whoever wins this, I have opened it, but only for discovery's sake, I'm not gonna use it. What are you? <gasps> what is this? I have no idea what this is, but it looks like a very small phone. And I've never seen anything like it. And I feel kind of like I'm in the future. And I also feel kind of like I'm in that Saturday Night Live skit where Will Ferrell pulls out his tiny, tiny cell phone. And I think it's hilarious. And I love the idea that it's noodle size for him to take his own personal calls right like this. Um, I also think that this is, <laughs> just kind of silly like I know that Jana probably has like a real phone but no you know what I'm not gonna speculate on that this might very well be her phone this is just a practical little device and it comes with its own case while we're here just give me a second really quick um, hello uh, Sally Mae yes I'm defaulting on all of my student loans from here on out hello Aunt Diane hi you wrote me out of the will Hello? Hello? Is my refrigerator what? Hello, employees. And you, can you hear me on the intercom that I've hooked up to a phone line? You can? Great. You're all fired. Jana, you are blowing my mind with what's in this box. The last item we have in here is the Infantino. We have the four-in-one convertible baby carrier. Which I think I think indicates that Jana may either herself be a mother or has a child that she finds she must strap to herself um, at any occasion. And I understand this because I have to schlep Noodle around most places because even though he is going to be 12 soon, Noodle is basically an infant. Whether you've got a kid or you've got just a kind of a 25 pound sort of old man baby, this is a great way to go about carrying your kid with you. I wonder if she brings her baby to work with her. This was a really cool thing that I noticed. A lot of people not only use this for when they're like moving from point A to point B, but they wear them when they're just kind of farting around the house. And I think this could be a really great example of how Jana balances her life and her business. What this tells me is that every single day, she is making it a point to not only nurture her business, but to take care of her family. And she puts her family first. And especially if she's someone who also makes it a point to give back into her community, I'm not surprised that she's also a fantastic mother. Okay, that's everything. Everything. That is everything in the Jana Heart box. I am so deeply inspired by the things that I saw. It was full of creative things. It was full of practical things and some bomb coffee. For all of you watching, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And if you loved this video or you just love Noodle and you can't get enough of his perfect angel face, head to our YouTube channel and don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell so that you can get notifications when a series like this or another GoDaddy series goes live. Thank you so much for watching and we can't wait to see you next time.